Hey there, true believers, and welcome back to Mike Meeple's Painting Poorly Miniature Painting Tutorials for Marvel Zombies by Kamon Games. Today, we're continuing our painting tutorial series on how to paint Galactus by learning how to paint his detachable living arm. It's maybe not the most exciting subject, but definitely a vital one. Like with his head, we'll be priming with some Chaos Black Spray Primer by Citadel. And once that's all dry, it's time to start with base coats. We'll be using the exact same techniques on his arm as we did with the helmet, painting the hand and purple portion of the arm with some royal purple by the army painter. Then using a mix of Zephyr Pink and Royal Purple by the Army Painter. and finishing off with a dry brush of pure Zephyr Pink, just like we did on his helmet in the previous tutorial. And if you'd like more clarification on this process, make sure you check out that video. Next, take some dark Prussian blue by Vallejo and paint the rest of his sleeve. Apply as many layers of paint as needed until you get a nice solid base color. Just make sure that your last coat is completely dry before you add another. After that, take some Prussian Blue by Vallejo and brush on another layer. Just like with the highlight, you'll want to paint over just about 90% of what's already covered, leaving the recessed portions the darker color. Then, take some Royal Blue by Vallejo and brush on another smaller layer. At this point, you'll also want to use a more traditional method to get in there and start applying some highlights to some specific areas, like the folds in the cloth. Next, mix together equal parts Royal Blue and Andrea Blue by Vallejo and apply some very sparing final highlights. After that, take your white and paint out the energy vent in the palm of his hand. Once that's dry, mix together one part fluorescent blue by Vallejo and five parts contrast medium by Citadel and apply that mix to the painted vent. In order to create a glow effect, I'll be mixing a little white and royal purple into the fluorescent blue mix and painting the tips of his fingertips, adding just a little bit more white as the glow would progress brighter until I have the look that I want. And that's it! I want to give a big shout out to all of my patrons whose generous support helped me make quality content like this. And if you're interested in becoming a patron yourself, information on how to do so can be found in the description for this video along with links to all the supplies I used today and a link to my blog where you'll find more tutorials for games like Marvel Zombies. 
And if you like this video and would like to see more, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Excelsior!